Yo, what's good, team? Welcome back to J3 Entertainment. We about to get that true reaction compilation experience. That's right. We back, y'all. What we got today, bro? Marvel vs. Capcom Fighting Evolution, 1994 to 2017. <laughs> yes. You know, these compilations is crazy, man. Because one thing I like about intros mm -hmm. is what brought you into it. Right. Yeah. So this this trip right here is gonna be a little different for me because this is gonna be on a cabin base. Okay. When I was a kid walking in. <laughs> Like the restaurant, the like arcade. the Chuck E. Cheese arcade. History. And you saw those intros mm -hmm. is what made you want to insert that coin. There right? it is. You know what I'm saying? Yes. So it's Facts. a little different. Ice beam. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, yo, like, I want to play this. You know what I'm saying? So mm -hmm. yeah, that's how I feel about this one. No, yeah. those are facts. Facts. Uh, the location plays a big deal. The people you were with, the family that you experienced it with, and then uh, how challenging those games were, but fun at the same time. You know what I'm saying? Right. So, And it was an interaction. And it was a public place. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Yeah. And you never the, wanted to leave on a loss. Yeah, before the <laughs> era of online. So, you know, gaming took a different approach then because, you know, it was a it was a gathering experience, whether yeah. it was strangers, friends, family, it was it brought people together. Kids will never kids today will never understand the feeling of losing and not having any more quarters. <laughs> and then getting great food afterwards. Right? Uh, yeah. When you were right there. <laughs> yeah, that is that is a big impact. Man. Like when you think about it. Uh, I remember the Delama Mall had an arcade. I remember that a long time ago, man. Uh, uh, that was something to go into, man. I remember that was the first time I played X Men, uh, the six uh, the six player cabin. Okay, the Konami oh, arcade game. Yeah, I remember yeah. that's the first time I Great played game. X Men. It was at the Delamo Mall, out there, uh, way back when. I remember that. Yeah, that's dope. Yeah. Back in the day. Yeah, that was. I was a kid. I was a yeah. kid. Kid. I was little. <laughs> Do you remember the first arcade game you ever played, or was that like just that? Uh, I think the first arcade game I ever played was Miss Pac Man. Okay. Me too. Okay. You know what I mean? Like my mom was playing it, and I was, I joined right on in. Let me ask you guys uh, here on the on the panel, and then for the audience, uh, you guys remember Pit Fighter? No, I gotta see it. Very like digitized graphics. It was a fighting game. You know, there was like three main characters: one was a wrestler, one was a kickboxer, and one was a martial artist. I don't remember. And that. it was like the era of like photorealistic, but still kind of fantasy. So like that yeah. Mortal Kombat style graphics. Where it's like digitized. Yeah, I gotta see yeah. it. I gotta see it. I gotta yeah. see it. Yeah, it was cool. Right. I remember what was it, Raid or Raisin? The 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 jet pilot game, and you just scroll side. Oh, to right, side. Then. right, right. Then. Yeah, okay. the yeah. overhead. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> what, was your, what was your fervent, uh, f fervent. What was your uh, first uh, arcade game Ooh. that you played in the arcade? TMNT. Turtles. Ooh, nice. TMNT. Very original. Yeah. Eighty nine. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, and then as far as fighting, probably uh, the real Street Fighter. If you go fighting, probably Darkstalkers. For, well, because that was the side scroll, but it yeah. probably be Darkstalkers for me. Darkstalkers is a great one. Yeah. Another I, Capcom gem. I remember more the, more, the Mortal Kombat cabin. Um, Did Virtual Fighter have a cabin? I don't remember. Which one? Virtual Fighter. Yes, it did. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> like, yep. I think they, uh, for the most part, all fighting games had a cabin. That was part of the uh, Sega AM2 era when they did uh, 3D fighters. Do you remember? Yeah. Do you remember the the Fight Night one, the one that had the gloves? Yes. Oh mm -hmm. man, I used to be on that one. Tough. <laughs> Good old days. But uh, y'all ready to react? Oh yeah. Man. yeah. Let's get these headphones on. All right. So we going back to '94. How are we getting there? Long, long time ago. Mm, how are we getting there? DeLorean. Um, you got DeLorean? DeLorean? Yeah. You got DeLorean? Great right. Scott. All right. You got the ride. Let's go. All right. So I'm not sitting on any lap, so I'm, I'm going to go ahead. I'm in the back seat. <laughs> I wish it had back seats. Hey, the feeling is definitely good. They put Jennifer in the back seat. Hey, <laughs> dang. Ah, <laughs> uh, nah. Um, let me see. I'm going to get That's to 94. Funny. I'm going to do a portal. All right. Yeah. Gonna do a portal. I'm okay. Gonna do a portal. Excellent. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> We're going to portal. I'm walking right in and walking out. <laughs> Savagery. Is that Arnold Schwarzenegger? All right. Yeah. There it is. Get your ass to Mars. <laughs> Come on. Let's do it. Y'all ready? Yeah. yeah. Man. Let's do it. Let's go. We're going to start this thing right now. <laughs> Spiral. Oh, man. And a uh, fun fact Akuma's a hidden character in the game. Mm -hmm. Yeah. They start slowly throwing him in. Okay, so it was before he showed up with Street Fighter. X. Okay. X -Man. Oh, man. Yep. Yep. Man, the sprite combo system still here. I love the sprite uh, graphic when it hit the spark light. <laughs> that big boater you care. Bobby got a problem, bro. Right? Man, the air combat system was dope, too. 
Look at this. Well, I think these games, are, these games are what made me a fan of Iceman in the first place, I believe. Yeah, because before I got my hand on, hands Ooh, on I got comics. Saturn at the house right now with the imported version of this. Oh, man. <laughs> Shout out to the air fighting system. Oh, man. Break the glass. Break the glass. Drill com. Yeah. Tight, yeah. tight, tight. Berserker Barrage. <laughs> Drill claw. Marvel Superheroes. Oh, Woo! Spider-Man is putting that work. Get so em. a little fun fact on this one. So the Super Nintendo game, uh, Marvel War of the Gems, started the whole Marvel vs. Universe, and then it went into Children of the Atom, and then it kind of went on after that. Tight, tight. So the Marvel story started. Yeah. Okay. It was on the Super NES. It started out as a side scroller adventure and then turned into a versus due to what happens. Okay. Yeah. Oh, yeah, Ooh. my girl. And then there was another one too, uh, X Men Mutant Apocalypse, which was a Super Nintendo game also. Yeah. Damn, this is tight, bro. Take right. me back. So there's a lot of history. Now, there is a story in between those that uh, leads into the Marvel vs. Capcom. No I've been loving all the Cyclops and Ryu memes of them getting back together, yeah, dapping it up. Like, that, that was dope. And then this one right here is an X Men vs. Street Fighter. Yeah. This one was great, too. It really was. Apocalypse being the final boss. Ooh, that's a, you do not want to get hit by that. Ah, uh, there it is. Yeah, thumbs up, soldier. You would think he'd be shaking uh, Guile's hand, right? It <laughs> just naturally just two soldier leader. Yeah. But it's definitely out of respect there, though. Marvel vs. Street Fighter. So I noticed that uh, some of the games had different uh, ports. The, the arcade versions were the best ones to play, and so the yeah. Saturn and the PlayStation ones were the only ways to get them. The other ones were just like mods. So everyone was like, to get the best one, I gotta import it, and then you get the converter. Advertising is dope. Yeah. Shumagora. <laughs> Sakura. Man. It's ahead of the time, man. Yeah. Yeah, I remember growing this up. This is the it. era of, hey, you want to battle? This is right? like the 90s was like fighting craze. Like everybody was doing this. Yep. See that price going up. Yeah. Two coins. I really hope they do a collection for uh, Capcom vs. SNK too when they bring in the King of Fighters. Yeah. They need to bring that back. But due to how well this does, I think we're going to get it, though. And uh, shout out to Evo for uh, having this playable at the event now. Zangie. For real? Yeah, they already announced it. Uh, reservation sold out because uh, they added Marvel vs. Capcom to the uh, to the roster. Tight. Mega Tight. Man. Beautiful. This one I got on Dreamcast. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah. Oh, I love Strider. Who? Strider. Okay. Yeah, he's a, he's a Capcom uh, yeah. mascot. I was trying to figure out, remember yeah. his name. He had an arcade game too mm -hmm. in uh, the cabinet back in the day. Ninja. Mm -hmm. Uh oh. Capcom presents. You. Yeah. Doom doom. Blackheart, Silver Samurai, Frank West from uh, Dead Rising, got the shopping cart full of weapons yep, yep, <laughs> to throw yep. you in the wall, uh, Nemesis, oh, yo. Marvel versus Capcom 2. Ultimate roster of all time. It was like 50 some 60 characters mm -hmm. in this one. It went crazy on this one. Tight, man. Man. Dude, these games are crazy. Hayato, Star Even Gladiator. smoothed up the background. Yep. Yeah. Cool. The best version of this game is of the Dreamcast one. Because it, it plays like the arcade. It was like way more polished. And stuff. <laughs> Bruh. Cable. The artwork's phenomenal. Yeah, man. Oh, yeah. Shout out to the artist, uh, Bangus, 
who did all the designs for the, the cover art of the games and stuff. Yeah. New era. <laughs> New dawn. Oh, man. Look at that. I love the ampl amp amp amplifying it. Putting the, uh, the characters in there. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Better visuals. More iconic vibes. This is where they start to uh, pull that style of like Street Fighter 4 and 5, mm -hmm. where it's still 2D, but the uh, fighters feel 3D and move 3D. Dante, my boy. Go oh, yeah, play. Virgil's That's in here too. Yeah, this was like peak uh, MVC right here. Yeah, man. And then uh, they came out with a version called Ultimate MVC 3, which added uh, extra characters. So it kind of improved on the very first uh, edition. Sorry. Man. I remember the Strider. Oh, hey, man. Spidey and Strider, that's a great team up. If you ever want to have them on your, on your squad. I remember I used to put uh, Spider-Man with Cyclops. The Merc. <laughs> Damn. Thanks. Enough said. <laughs> oh, uh, Wesker. 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 There he is. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Virgil versus Wolverine. Oh, I think man. these games were made Wolverine that that do. Yeah. Oh yeah. Because when you're focusing on their powers and abilities, oh yeah, you get to see that what they how they really get down, how they operate. Tight shot. It works. Tight shot. Galactus sitting back there like that. Ultimate. Yes. This is actually the game that got me into uh, Devil May Cry. Oh, nice. Man, hurry up, December. Here it is, y'all. Infinite. Right, See, I did the improvements, man. but it takes something away, you know? Yeah. Yeah. And these are just like the cutscenes and stuff, yeah. Yeah, fight system was not the same after this one. It was mm -hmm. very stiff. Combat. And they were both uh, a lot of characters yeah. still. Hey. They didn't bring that Captain Marvel back. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Please, <laughs> I'll knock right you back to another universe. I'll try. Oh man, Shook like down we got dropped off line. in 2017. Man, Bro. I gotta catch a buzz back. <laughs> right? For real. Nah, it's always fun, man. Just seeing the, the intros, man. I kind of yeah. want to. I want to uh, see if we can find a list that has like, like Doc Starkers, all this stuff like that. All of them. The like, Capcom yeah, list, yeah. The yeah. Capcom list, yeah. That's fun. That's be fun. great. Short but sweet. You yeah. know what I mean? I'm gonna need that controller so I can get that time jump for you. Get up in there, win a few fights. Let's get up out of here. Right. right. <laughs> like that. We need we need this style of game back, bro. Oh yes. Like. And and the 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 characters that have that legacy that were in those games mm -hmm. are big time characters, man. They they legendary. Well, except for Captain Marvel. But <laughs> nah, she's legendary she, too. She's yeah, there. she's been around she's for a while. There. But like the 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 memories of those games is just how much because those games were pure fun, right? They 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 it's weren't competitive fun. Yeah, it was yeah it was, yeah, it was a genre, competitive yeah. fun. Like, can you see me? 
Like, <laughs> that's pretty much what it was. Phenomenal. And yeah. you know, I'm gaming changed. You know, what I mean, some kids are not as competitive as normal, but for the most part, it's good to see the franchise still going and them getting a reboot of of bringing all the games back out, so you can buy as a collection edition. So that's really cool and played on the new consoles. Uh, but yeah, this it, I mean, it's fun. You know, what I mean. It was fun. I, I, I want to know what you guys think in the comments down below. How much fun do you guys have watching this? And what was your first arcade game you played and your first arcade fighting game you played? I want to know. And if you never had that experience, tell us what, would you, where, what time would you want to have had that experience? There mm -hmm. go one. That's a good one. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? That's a great one. Uh, but guess what? It's not about us. It's about, about y'all. Post your comments down below. Let us know how much fun you guys had. If you're new to the channel, go ahead and press the subscribe button. Thumbs this video up. Don't forget to share Instagram, Facebook, Twitter. Also, follow us on Instagram, Twitter, and Patreon. Y'all know what to do. Press the button. I'm J3. Run the show. Woo! Ninja Assassin. It's your boy C. Road to 100,000 subscribers.